All right, what is good, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another YouTube video. Leave a like and if you subscribe, if you are new. Man, I, again, so much content has dropped. I, I don't even know where to start when it comes to these videos and everything. But hey, I just we coast through them, we get through them, and I show you guys what I see or what I think is important for everybody to see, or just things that I notice from all these games or all these footage that's coming out from again all these content creators who are just giving us. The food man he's just giving it all to us to enjoy and i i really appreciate that first up i'm going to be actually scrolling through my through my timeline of videos and footage that i found just little clips of stuff that i found of sparking zero just giving y'all like a sense of what i've been seeing like i've definitely been keeping up just haven't been posting um as a small creator again you don't want to put too much on yourself to try to post and keep up with whatever whatever's going on take your time gather the footage you need and then assess it and then draw it out in a different way so what we're gonna be looking at is just my again. My, I bookmarked so many things. Timeline full of things. So the, right here we have the burst open All and mix. Of weird, you know, um, what Vegeta Goku transforming into great memories when he landed that. on Earth, kind of stuff. Thank and what I like about this is again, it's the same as Tenkai Eight Three, but it just am animating it to give us the feel like we're literally in the anime. And he looks ginormous. Like, he just looks big. Like I don't know. I seen a picture of him compared to Gohan, and that was that was a crazy pick. So I enjoyed that transformation. Next we have his uh, not ring. It's called the Gallic Super Gallic Gun. And beyond Dragon Ball, and just this definitely Google wasn't Tenkai Eight Three. Um, I actually did I mean. a comparison video of uh, the two, an uh, comparing joy and a one and the other. And literally, the Tenkai Eight Three version is so fast. It's like it actually. I don't even think I actually think they're the same speed. The only thing is like Vegeta's. They actually put animation into it, so it's like there's cuts into the face, and it's like they zoom in and like. There's like actual like setup, whereas the Take IG3 version kind of just gets into the move da -da 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 -da, and just hits him and blasts him away, which again at the time was awesome, but definitely improved on it later on. Um, right here we have my edit here. I'm gonna show you a I was literally saying how crispy was. We have a little, literally a hint at what I think is is a Broly movie uh uh character movie hint. Because this came from that movie, Second Coming, and this is literally the brother and uh, the brother Kamehameha that Gohan and uh, Goten did. So, what if we see Z Broly? Which I think we're definitely gonna see. Z Broly. I don't know. He's a fan favorite, and every game kind of has Broly. What game doesn't have Broly? I don't know. You tell me. Um, next up, we're gonna be getting into. Um, this uh so this is what i believe is and broly like, you know and gohan gameplay everything that broly's capable and so, of doing so we go from his fury state to super saiyan at that point his moves change so now he has gigantic okay so cannon. i like that again transformation changes the moves i think I, that is a great way to introduce technicalities and uh, give a more in-depth uh and diverse character move set to everyone and the fact that I hear that again, alternate costumes will definitely let me have move sets would be great. Let's start transforming to see everything that Broly's capable of doing. So we go from his fury state to Super Saiyan. At that point, his moves change. So now he has Gigantic Cannon, which is his uh, blast move, and Gigantic Rage. Oh! And then we finally. I like the clashes. Now the clashes is one of the best things they've added in this game because. It's not a thing that they quite added, but it's like they innovated in a way that every instance has a clash. We have a we have a grab clash. We have these clashes. Um, Xenoverse has these, but it's like you don't do anything. This one is literally you actually have to do something. Um, you get to see the strike clash. And so now, yeah, again, that, it it's called a strike clash. Differently from how it does in Takaichi Three because you have the option to boost it, but you need to make sure that. So yeah, that's good. We have the option to now boost our uh, strike clashes. And that's, that's actually going to be the key. I wonder how the boost is going to work, though. It might be a gauge type thing. I don't know. Closing in gets into, like, the gauge, and then you press at the right time to really boost it. Okay. But anyway, so I end up throwing out uh, Broly's ultimate blast against Gohan. Deals good damage. And then from there, I just want to make sure that I start testing out as many moves as possible. So next up, I throw out Gigantic Cannon. Dealt good damage. And then afterwards, I just wanted to make sure that I used uh, Gigantic Rage before going to full power Super Saiyan. Oh. Now, with Gigantic oh, Rage... Oh, so it missed. It had... Okay. It's one of those um, rush-in moves that just go straight forward and you have no control over it. So, okay. Uh, you're going to see me try to land that move multiple times, 
but again, it has one trajectory, so as long as Gohan like sidesteps there's, up. There's gotta be a way to aim it. I think they should add a way to aim it. Or like kinda like press it in a way that when you when you do rush in, you can stop it. I don't know. It is, so there's gotta be a way to innovate that. There's the gotta way, be a way to the move is going to miss. So Luckily, this time, since okay. he's next to the wall, I was able to connect the move. And, it, bro, Ooh. Broly is just Ooh. dealing damage, bro. That's all he do. That's all he do. That's all he so, do, uh, bro. That, that is crazy, man. That is crazy. I got oh, look, the picture that Dota, uh, Dota posted. Yo, literally look at the comparison. That man is ginormous. That is crazy. Look at that. This is Vegeta, that's not Vegeta, Goku, uh, Super Saiyan uh, 2, I believe. Yeah, this is definitely Super Saiyan 2. He has the, aim, the Halo and everything. I like this uh, version of him right here. It's really good. This is where I was talking about the manga evolution. Um, they, they really did emphasize that this is going to be the manga version of that evolution form. So I wonder if they're going to have some type of like manga character. I don't know. This is good. I don't know. Them, them doing it, the manga version really just kind of... Uh, sets it apart. But I don't know. Leave like I don't know. Leave, leave a comment. But I don't know. Leave a comment on the video. What do you guys think? Is this Super Saiyan uh, Blue evolved the manga version? And if, and if it's not, I mean, they have manga moves, so I don't know. If, if you don't think it is, it might be delusional. But if you think that this means they're gonna add manga content or more manga content in the game, let me know. Uh, we have the shirtless battle damage again. Battle damage. You can literally finish the battle with them shirtless. Not saying that it's like a I think we want like that, but it's like one of them things that like shows the detail of again the real time anime fights. You're not going to be coming out of a, of, a, of a battle unscathed with just your sh shirt and stuff all clean and and just scratches. Like no, you, you're gonna things are gonna be torn apart and everything like that. And so uh, we get into more. I think it's beers and all that stuff. You got some more pickle gate, all that good stuff. So I think all I had for you guys for right now. Again, there was so many, so much footage that came out. But these were just the, again the most important ones that I've seen that we can actually break down and give gameplay and give our thoughts on. Um, do you have some more uh, beers gameplay? We can actually get into this right now. Let's get into more beers gameplay. Then we'll come out. Uh, beers, by the way, is. Uh, going against a uh, Super Saiyan or Super yeah Super Saiyan Vegeta or Super Vegeta when he's in buff form. So this would be a nice way to see how his uh, move set is, which again, pretty pretty looking. He looks buff as hell, like big. Oh my god, he goes straight into it. They love using that move. I kind of want to see him do an ultimate with, with Vegeta. I want to see if he does one. It's gonna be sick. I think I think he ends up using his uh, beers destruction. So he has more so beers gameplay. We have Gogeta gameplay right here. It's again. I told you I was so much footage, bro. It's so much. It's so much. He's literally fighting himself. It's so funny. I kind of want to see Soul Punisher. If you guys haven't seen Soul Punisher by now, this this move right here slaps. Look at this. Boom. Ooh. Look at the destruction it causes. But yeah. I just want to end it off here to show you guys a little bit of my timeline, show you guys a little bit what I've been experiencing, what has been the hype. Let me know if I missed anything. Let me know and D actually DM me if in my Twitter if you guys want to share some content with me while I'm out of the country and all that good stuff. Leave a like on this video, subscribe if you're in there. We can get on some more Sparky Zero content. Peace.